Guys, so today I'm going to show you how to change a bulb on Mazak 250. Uh, I've, I didn't knew exactly how to open it up and I just opened up the whole assembly but uh, there's a uh, easier way which we can do. At, I'll show you how to do it in at the end of the video but this is the 4 pin bulb which goes into this socket here. Um, just push it in and uh, it, it just clips it in and, and uh, there are two these tiny wire uh, uh, clips which goes on top of the uh, the bulb just so that uh, to protect it it doesn't come out and uh, there's this metal plate which goes on top of the bulb and uh, just wipe it off the shinier it is uh, the more uh, light is gonna be uh, reflecting so make sure it is pretty shiny and then just uh, put this thing in uh, in this uh, glass case and now the bulb goes inside and you can uh, tighten up the thread make sure guys that it's pretty snug because you don't want the coolant going inside it so uh, if needed use these uh, these yellow and black uh, clamp uh, the, the what is it called uh, I'm not sure what they call it but you, you can use these wrenches to uh, uh, secure or tighten it up uh, pretty uh, pretty good there's this uh, seal goes on top of it which also protects uh, anything going inside the electrical uh, wires and there's this hexagon uh, nut which goes on top of it and uh, right now I, I was just tightening it up by hand but uh, it is recommended I would say just go with the wrench not don't uh, tighten it up uh, too too uh, uh, hard you might break it so maybe just go lightly with the wrench in, rather than with your hand so God, uh, this is this seems good right now make sure it's all clean and now we can put it back in the machine there are two wires black and uh, red so make sure just take it out and uh, put it back in the way you take it out so guys uh, make sure when you put the wires in just put them the way you took it off took them out so the red one goes into the black and the black goes into the red It's a little bit tricky because uh, the weight the weight is hanging uh, down there, so you might need a hand so that somebody can grab the bulb from below, and then you can uh, put the wire in and then put the screws in to hold uh, the wire on the top. Just make sure the wires. Uh, try to put one wire before uh, you can play around with the second one. It, it's easier that way. There you go. One is in. And do the same thing with the second one. Put it in and uh, tighten up the screw. So now, once the wires are in, we gonna put everything back together. And uh, there are four cap screws, which is gonna go on to on uh, the slide on all four sides on all four corners make sure uh, it is pretty snug once we do this and uh, we don't want any water going inside any, any any dust particle or any chips going inside so next time this happens again uh, I know now I don't have to take out this whole assembly it is going to be easier 
to take out this uh, glass thing which is uh, at the below here and uh, I can use those uh, wrenches the rubber wrenches I'm not sure what, what they really call okay guys I hope you enjoyed the video please comment down below for any questions click the bell icon and please subscribe to with the machining and I will keep adding more videos thanks a lot